I'm definitely questioning my homosexuality. Somebody's prayers has been answered in my family at this point. Hello. Hi. My name is Saint. I am 27 years old. How many mouths have you been intimate with? Ooh. Many. <laughs> I'm actually a dental hygienist. I once had a patient who maybe got a little bit turned on from the dental appointment, from my hands being in his mouth. Are you turned on by your work? Never, <laughs> no. Today, you're going to match kiss to person. You nervous? <laughs> yeah, because I'm like, I've kissed a girl, but I've never kissed a girl. I don't know. <laughs> like, How many people have you kissed in your life? Was I supposed to keep track? <laughs> Under 100, but over 50. I'm gay, so it's like a lot. 200 plus. We're gonna blindfold you. I think I can do this. I'm ready. <sighs> Check it out. All right, we're gonna bring them in. They look as nervous as you. Oh, oh yeah. I'm a little nervous and a little excited. Will you tell these folks your boundaries, what you like? I don't have boundaries. Tongue's great. Is there a wall here? You could just like pick me up and like on the wall. That You could do that too if there's a wall there. All right, I am ready. Bring it on. Wow, okay. That was a really good kiss. They kiss like they're very attractive. I would say they're used to kissing other women. That was just a sexy kiss. This person knows what they're doing and just went all the way with it. I feel like they're white. <laughs> it definitely felt like a female or someone that's like feminine presenting. Definitely short because I felt like the arms were coming from like below my chest. Had like kind of a youthful sort of like presence and like feel. I would say this is a 20 year old. Yeah. Okay, all right. It's a little too, like, right out the gate aggressive for me. Couldn't wait to kiss me. That's the vibe I got from it. I just experienced a really good kiss. That tasted like this person was, like, recently chewing gum or just brushed their teeth. Not a very textured lip, a powerful lip. You kiss and smell like you like anime. You, s like, <laughs> do you wear, like, a TV show or, like, a cartoon on your shirt? What about the kiss? It was very forceful. I'd give that, like, a six. That's a 10. I sensed a little bit hesitation, but still, like, felt pretty comfortable. The taste was good. This person was, like, fresh. Of the kissers so far, this kiss maybe has not kissed as much as the other, but that didn't make it bad. I'm definitely questioning my homosexuality. Somebody's prayers has been answered in my family at this point, because that shit was, it was great. Any advice for these last three people? I want someone to pick me up and like spin me around. <laughs> That's <a> me. <laughs> That was good. I do have a hair in my mouth, though. What the fuck was that? No offense to you, but I do not like facial hair. I think it was like a very average kiss. There was times when the tempo was a little off. This person had like a firmer tongue. Generally, tongues get a little bit firmer as people get older. So this, this person is gonna be in the 30 to 40 year old range. Do you have a receding hairline? What makes you think that? Because they have a lot of facial hair, so I'm like, they're compensating for something, right? <laughs> I'm sorry about that one. Oh. Ooh, okay. 
getting butterflies from that kiss. I'll meet you out back. That was a 10. That was like the, the other one. Shit, that's, that's a Hispanic woman with a middle part, black long hair. <laughs> I felt something really interesting there that I have not felt yet, and that's an oral piercing. I would say this has been my favorite so far. Yeah, absolutely. Last kiss here for you, Saint, when you're ready. I'm ready. Oh, fuck. Sorry, I gotta get myself together. That was like a really like rapid fire, like make out soft cheeks. Hmm, medium firm tongue, you know, maybe like later 20s. That was like, oh my God, I'm so sorry, a two. I just felt like I was just being ate the fuck up. I am so sorry. They seemed very experienced. The tempo was a little too fast for me. Plus for lifting me up though. Everybody's gonna shuffle around so you can't tell oh, who's no. who. You can take your blindfold out. What's up? <laughs> <laughs> okay, first kiss. Uh, yeah, now that I really, really enjoyed that one. It was very intimate. The first person had to bring me down the lowest, so you know, I would say that would be you. <laughs> I remember she was short and had curly hair. Oh, they kissed like they were very attractive. Third person right there. I remember them like going in for it. Kind of like aggressive in a way. And you look really aggressive. It's the boots. Like I feel like you just like, you walk in like you. She's my first one. My second kisser was someone who was average height. I think the fourth person right here. He's someone who was excited to kiss me. That's what that second one felt like. <laughs> my second kiss was the anime fan. I definitely feel like it's this one right here, the guy. So my third kiss, I remember them being hesitant. I believe it was the fifth person. Oh my gosh, it's my homegirl right here. 10 out of 10, number three. You definitely made me question my homosexuality. I didn't think I can kiss a girl like that. I guess because like I had on like a blindfold. This person was a little bit on the lesser of the experience side, but higher on energy side. Softer also. I'm gonna go with, with you. Fourth kiss, that's a man. Oh, oh my God, it's fucking scientists at the end. <laughs> he left his hair in my mouth. <laughs> this person had like a stiffer tongue. I would say it's you on the end there. My fifth one. This was a lovely kiss. I'm pretty sure I said to go meet me out on the back so we could kiss some more. And I felt the oral piercing on her mouth. I see one person here who has an oral piercing. That would be this person here. I pictured a middle part. That was good. Um, yeah. Just hit me up after this. <laughs> I think you were my last kisser. I think it was a little too fast paced for my liking. I think it's you right there. This person had more like nervous energy, but also like really ready to go. Did not hold back. And I would say this would be the fifth person. <laughs> Who did Tracy guess correctly? Dang, really? What the fuck? <laughs> Fuck yeah. <laughs> I got you wrong. Yes. Um, so which kiss were you at? I was the last one. You thought I was very experienced. You're actually my fourth kiss ever. Okay. So that means three of my kisses were today. <laughs> Is that by choice? I'm or? asexual. It's not the biggest goal in my life. As I've gotten older, I'm like, yeah, I do want to find yeah. romance and find someone. You know, I'm mm -hmm. behind on times. So let me just kiss a bunch of strangers. Yeah. <laughs> so you're the 10. You're not the 10. Shut up! Hi. Really? <laughs> you were questioning your sexuality. Yeah, I was How definitely you questioning. How do now that you see me? Um, still questioning. Hey. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so I'm curious like how I did, honestly. Nervous and tentative. You were Ooh. definitely expecting us to lead you. That tracks, honestly. Yeah. <laughs> but you have very soft lips and a great tongue. Thank you. Your favorite kiss was with Laura. It was. You want to share one more kiss? Okay. <laughs> this one's gonna be more intimate. We're gonna clear everybody else off set. Thank you very much. <laughs> okay, okay. Are you ready? Okay. Thank you.
Oh, oh man. We'll see you guys later. I'm just kidding. <laughs>